हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आई सोमा कर्मकार वेलकम्स यू टू द ई क्लासेस ऑफ बर्ड वन मॉडल स्कूल आई विल टेक योर मैथ्स एज यू नो ओके डायरेक्टली आई एम कमिंग टू योर स्टडीज फॉर मैथ्स वी हैव टू बुक्स वन इज द मैथ मैजिक दिस इज अवर एन सी आर टी बुक एंड यू हैव टू फॉलो दिस बुक क्लियर दिस एन सी आर टी बुक इज द मेन बुक फॉर योर क्लास थ्री एंड इट इज अ टेक्सट बुक here i will request to the guardians that please when your kid is learning this textbook you also go through the book and try to make them understand book okay now the second book for our maths is the private publication that is the composite mathematics for class 3 so we will deal with these two books in the whole curriculum for this year clear okay now come to the first chapter of our book the first chapter is where to look from as you know the chapter name is where to look from you are just surprising that uh, how this is for the maths and how we will tackle it where to look from like maths but this is the maths and it is giving you a okay in this first chapter where to look from you will read that here the students of class 3 they are discussing about a picture okay in the first page it is given that the students they are discussing about a picture a picture is drawn of a car by three students and all the three they have drawn in different ways okay first one is dheeraj he has drawn only a box second one is anshul anshul has drawn the side view of a car and seeing dheeraj's book dheeraj's picture all are laughing because it is looking like a matchbox now here comes the views this i i will introduce a views to you okay views means in which direction or in which way you are looking to the sub objects suppose if you are looking this duster if you are looking this duster this is the front view clear this is the front view as you are looking to me i am the front view i am present before you i am the front view clear when the same duster when you are looking from the down you will look the top view clear you will look the top view similarly when i am standing before a uh, and you are watching me over from a third floor building you will see my head only my head that means only the top view of my head clear so these are the views suppose i am standing like this clear suppose i am standing like this you are looking my side view my side view i have one ear one eyes one leg but it is not exact isn't it so this is called the side view similarly when you i am turning to you this is the front view understood so these are the views in your book a table is given it is given the top view it is given the side view of the table suppose you are standing before a mirror it will give you the front view clear it will give you the front view now in your book there are some more examples are given which you will read or which you will follow and you will understand one is given a pressure cooker the side view of the pressure cooker is given second is given the cupboard the cupboard front view of the cupboard is given similarly there are some more examples which are given in your book which will clear you the views how the views are now come to the next page here some more examples are given a very a very uh, good example is given a class is going on this you can see a class is going on and a cat he is peeping from the top so according to the cat he is only seeing the top view of the class from a window similarly there are some more examples you can see the first example is given the stairs or the staircase in this staircase there are two views given this first one is the side view of the staircase then second one is given the front view of the staircase when you just go from the staircase that will be the front view and this one is the side view of the staircase so children you have to uh, go through this book clear now some more examples are given the third example is given the table table it is the 
top view is given for the table. Second comes the chair. As you know this chair, it is also given the side view of the chair. Next, can you guess what is this? Exactly, you are right. This is the pencil and the pencil, the top view is given. Only you can see the lid. That means only the writing part you can see but the wooden part you are unable to see. So, it means that you are in the top view. You are seeing the top view of the pencil. Similarly, this is the bus. You have, you are uh, traveling in the bus, you are seeing the side view, front view, every views you are seeing, not the top view. Okay, you are not seeing the top view, <laughs> yes, but you can see the front view, you can see the side views. So, in your book, this is given the side view of the table, sorry, side view of the bus. Similarly, there are many examples given in your book. You will go through the examples, just write it over here, what are the views, clear? So, this is your activity for today that you will write the views, the different views which is given in your book. Now, here comes, here comes one more thing, the pattern. In this chapter, you are reading the views first of all and second you are reading the patterns or the symmetry, the symmetry of the things. Suppose, these are my two hands, two palms, okay. When I am joining, you can see this two palms. When I am overlapping or when I am just joining the two hands, you can see only the either the left hand or the right hand. You are unable to see both the hands. Clear? When I am looking, I am showing you like this, you can see the side view. When I am showing you like this, you can see only the front view of my right hand. And this is the front view of the left hand. Okay. Now, here comes the symmetry. Uh, introduction to symmetry clear when I am overlapping these two hands that means my left hand is totally symmetrical over my right hand is that clear so I have this is the symmetry similarly there are many alphabets or many numbers which follow the symmetry suppose you are overlapping on each other it will be the symmetry clear suppose you are writing for symmetry for symmetry suppose you are writing number 8 number 8 you can overlap on each other that means if I am holding number 8 from the middle this circle will overlap on the first circle that means this follows the symmetry Clear? So, this is the symmetrical figure. Suppose I am writing alphabet A. Alphabet A. When I am overlapping the left over the right, it will also follow the symmetry. Okay. When just I am overlapping this A on this, this is called the symmetrical alphabets. So, there are many alphabets which are symmetrical to each other. Even there are many numbers which are symmetrical to each other. So, children just think, I am giving you this as homework, just think which numbers are symmetrical and which numbers or which alphabets are symmetrical. Clear? So, this is your homework for today. One is the symmetrical alphabets and figure numbers and second one from your math magic that is page number 2 you will write all the views as I have given the introduction the views of this names of the stairs then the pencil then the bus all the views what these views you are able to see you will write over here clear. So, these two are the activities for you for today is that clear ok thank you all of you.